Hey Sora, what do you think about this amazing Let's Play so far? I guess that's not what, what I asked, but anyways. Hey folks, welcome back to Port Pokemon Z on the Azure Blaze, and we have another trailer battle. We're going to continue the rest of part 308, because we did some, we had some pretty bad times, and some good times. But still, again, Mina sucks, having a really horrible time, and then we have a really, oh god. Well, this is going to hurt us, because that was this is probably this is a bad, bad situation right now. Let's see, let's see if we get Guy out here against a clone of Mina. Let's see if this, this Mina can take that. Really? You, you want Sora out? No. I say no, good sir. Let's get Guy out here. Gust. Well, you're not getting you know, that easy. Go with the headbutt. Hopefully it flinches. Never mind. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Why is Bulb being just too... Play attack. Oof. Ball beam should just. It's good solid. Ooh, and speed fell. Awesome. What a good what a good win for Gaia, of course. Nice job, Gaia. Good job, buddy. Level oh, 25, nice. Also Venusaur, I believe, so level Ooh! <laughs> oh, man. Gaia is still behind, but still a very interest Okay, well, I not using physical buddy. Then use quick attack to just try to take me out. Guy with a bull beam. And it's, again, speed falling down. There we go. Guy is on a roll. There we go. Our heroic champion once again. 24. Nice. Get a lot of experience. And then we have Swallow. All the, all the generation Pokemon that are flying type Swallow. Pidgeotto and uh, Staravia all evolved pretty, pretty early in the game. That's the best challenge that actually adds to your Pokedex, especially when it comes to, uh... Uh, sorry, if you, it's just a Swallow, with this Pokemon adds to your Pokedex, and a- WHOA! One shot, critical hit! Damn! And Gaia's just catch it- Oh, that was so close. Oh, man, what a... For Pokemon, well... <laughs> let's, let's, let's talk a little bit something about strategy, pal. That was just some, some pure luck. Wow. One guy's on a roll. This, you know, that sniper ability is really nice, too. Remember that sniper ability, the pre screen hit ratio. So, once again, guy becoming a huge champion. So, it's a, I guess guy will get some experience just to level up on, uh, on, uh, on Sora and Mina. So, they're both doing, they're actually getting a little bit better now. This episode, a little bit. And, uh, I'll probably just some repels after this. Okay, first of all, spraying repels. Okay, good. <laughs> there we go. I'll have to get confused for the champion in Candle Region, but do you really think I'm like the favorite trainer? I don't know, let's find out, pal. <laughs> Ranger Blue. <laughs> Just like any. <laughs> what? Oh my, the more Power Ranger references. Wow. Well, they have a Spinda. This year, the Blue Ranger. Thanks for telling me that, buddy. All right, headbutt should do decent. Do I get flinched though? Maybe not. Fade attack. Okay. Uproar. Oof. Wait, what? What? Oh my God, that's that's terrible. I'll probably totally into knock out. Spend it. There we go. Just in time. And level twenty-five. Nice. Excellent. And now we have a nurse friend, of course. Let's get out Mai here, just for some extra cameo appearances. Mai just in the background, I guess. Alright, let's do also 25. So this is a good chance to get some level up, so train do some training for the gym battles in uh, Agassiz City, Agassiz Town Gym. Train attack. Ooh. Well, Flinders, Flinders is going to do a lot more damage, increase her speed. Oh, Mai, a critical hit. There we go. A lot, of hits, a lot of critical hits today in this one. And level 25, awesome. And, well, Fire Spin, nah. We're only 50 levels away from, from Volvo to Rapid Ash, so. Came a little closer. Nah, I'm not going to do this. Yeah, Fire Spin. 
It's okay. Numel, fire ground. So, oh, oh, there's a Pokemon after Pokedex. Numel, a fire ground type. So, my guy should be have some time to quad knock it out. <laughs> All right, guy, let's go, buddy. Speaking of blue, yeah. Oh, if you also notice, you notice that every Numel has the uh, the hump. If you look, you notice the hump on Numel's back. The the female has a has a bigger hump than the males, which is like kind of like you see like the women have like the bigger hits for when it comes to childbirth, so. Good old scientific fact because for Pokemon and and actually and the human analogy. The human body. I say analogy, wow, that's different. <laughs> what a fun battle. Good game. GG dude, GG. Let's see a trainer here, I guess the hmm, this is revive, I guess. I guess it is something I don't know. We do have a bug catcher, so I'm gonna do what we can do right now. I guess we can switch out for um. Let's do mean up. I know Mina's having a good time. Have a good, we'll have a good time in this route because definitely have some good chances in this route. Hopefully, just do some. Good for you. <laughs> good for you, buddy. All right, Hans. More like Han Solo, if you ask me. Guess that I did. I, I also I did see Star Wars Episode Seven, by the way. So, good movie, by the way. Oh God, Fairy Tale. Well, hopefully, those crits are just dangerous. This time we're actually pretty, pretty bulky ourselves. So, but yeah, I did see Star Wars Episode Seven with one of my friends on um, recently last week. It was a fun movie to watch. I really appreciate it, everybody. It was a, it, my first thoughts. It was really good. Really, really good. Very interesting to see the see the Hansel back in there, Harrison Ford back in there. Uh, yeah, three PO, very veteran like. And I really admit he, he's done a great job out there. He's Han Solo, and you still got Harrison Ford and Han Solo. Very talented, very talented actor, of course. And Chewie's back, which I love Chewie though. It's very very funny to see Chewie back in there. And we have this parrot. Also, also we got parasect here, which actually is having to give us a little bit of problems with Mina. Holy Mina can wake up a little bit. Uh, not really. Not yet. Purika. Really? You got like the worst bug moves. What are you doing, buddy? There we go. Mina. Eh. Oh, and then we got the critical hit. Then. It's like every time the critical hit always connects on the second play, and then useless crit. Well, he's got a little twenty-six though. You know, that's still a lot of catching up to do. Hurt my dearest friends. <laughs> a move that you got a move that Pokemon that knows like ten base moves. We got a revive here. Nice, excellent for the but just, just so you have a fancy Pokemon just to bring back. Like having a Phoenix down for Final Fantasy. But that's every, I think it's, that's everything else that you need to do actually in this route. I believe you get a Super Potion. I, I think you can. I know you can get a Super. Potion. There we go, right here. Two, two super potions. Whoa. Okay. Now this is being generous. We got to revive the super potion right there. Oh, jeez. Yes. Let's just get over, get out of here, and head, head down south. And we are out of the. And now we're in. Kariba Town or Kariba Town or Kariba Town. Land of Karibos, ladies and gentlemen. We have a Karibo episode. <laughs> Anyways, we finally arrived in a little short episode just to wrap things up for Route, for route uh, 308. And we're finally arriving at our newest destination, Kariba Town. I guess, but there's probably a gym here somewhere. I don't know there's a gym here. I'm pretty sure there is. If not, then I'm just... Very quiet. Very quiet town, actually, by the way. No, it always is one. No. So over there, I guess we can probably see the visit here. But anyways... I'm guessing that's why the water. And I, I don't. I don't think the water. Some people actually just heard this. Other, looked at something like the, the water. I, don't know. I have no idea what, what's going on here. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure this is like the water. If you guys can see like the, down in the, in the cliffs, that's why the water. Maybe the game was glitched out. I guess I have no idea. Maybe it's something else that it's probably that's connected to something. I have no. I also I don't even know. 
Anyways, that's gonna be it for this part. I guess we'll see you guys next time for part number 24, where we'll explore the rest of this Sorbonne Kariba Town. Or Kribo Town, what do you want to call it? Peace out, guys.